Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and today I am sharing an Easter decorate with me and come shop with me. So we'll be going to Kmart, Target and Bed Bath and & Table and then I might share a mini haul of what I actually purchase. I'm not going to go crazy and purchase lots of things. To be honest I'm just going to do it quite minimalistic because I don't really decorate that much for Easter. It's only something I've done in the last year or so just because I've got a five-year-old just to get into that Easter spirit. So I hope you guys enjoy today's video. And of course, if you do, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And um, let's go and get stuck into it. We have all of our Christmas and Easter decor in here. There's actually not that much, but the rule is I'm not allowed to go past this box. So let's see what's actually in this box and see how much room I've got, because that is the limit I have to what I'm allowed to purchase today if I go out and purchase anything and I want to see what I've actually got in here. So let's crack her open. And you can see it's mainly Christmas. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a lot of Easter. Oh no, that's a Christmas tree. Okay, this is what I've got to decorate with. I have these from Bed Bath & Table that I got last year. I know they've still got them in stock if anyone's interested. And these were also from Bed Bath & Table, which I actually got from an op shop, which is awesome. And then I got the, this from Bed Bath & Table. And then I've got a couple of Kmart bits here. A table runner. I've got an Easter sign. This here, I actually don't love it. Like, I just think that that bunny looks really tacky. But anyway, um, I have my other bunny. And then in here was the, I'm not gonna open it. I'll open it when I get inside, is the dome that I had from last year. So this is pretty much all my decor. And then I've got some bunnies and Talia's room that I'm gonna be using as well. Wondering if thousands of miles away, the sky's just as blue. It's as if I'm stuck in yesterday When I'm thinking of you Cause when you have your morning coffee I'm turning out the lights so I could dream And when you smile through the screen I wish you could be with me So I lay my head to rest When the sun is rising I'll start a brand new day Closing your eyes, I will be beside you And my heart will glide across the miles To fly right to you Cause when I dive into the traffic The echo of your voice is all I hear I'm never tired of your laughing so far But ever so near So I lay my head to rest When the sun is rising I start a brand new day around the moon is shining I long to be with you Okay, so it seems like it's time to finally head out to the shops. I definitely need a plate stand for the plate because I know where I'm gonna put that. And I wanna do like a little DIY on this here. So I have an idea what I wanna put in there. I saw it when I went to Kmart. So I'm just going to do a little like Kmart hack if they've still got it. And I think that's it. So let's head shopping and get our last little bits. And then I'll share the final reveal with you guys.
Okay, so just come back from Kmart and I got this one here, which was the gift bag for one dollar. And I'm gonna do the DIY with this. I was gonna use the placemat, uh, but it faced the wrong way, and when I saw it, it wasn't as good as what I remembered last time. So yeah, hopefully this works out because it's got the bits on the top. So see how it comes out. Then I got from, uh, it was like Better Bargains or something like that, or Spoils or something, one of those cheap shops. I got uh, just a plate stand for $3. This is the closest thing I can get to a plate stand. It's like a easel multi-purpose thing. I think it's more like, you know, for, yeah, as I said, like a iPad or something like that. And then from Target, I absolutely love this. This is so beautiful, I think because I can't remember, it will be in the video somewhere. It was $16, I think. But yeah, it has a little bunny's tail. So it's got the elastic there. This ties up at the back. So, you know, it's one size fits all. And then it's got like a bunny fluffy wand and then you've got your mask. But I think this is just so cute. It's gonna look so gorgeous in photos as well. And I think that this like goes so nicely with her bedroom as well. So I can put this on her coat hangers uh, that are on display in her bedroom and I can put this up next year and it's gonna really match in and blend in with her decor. <laughs> guys this is how we're looking really cute you can see it properly all the little zones in the home that looks really cute I'm pretty happy with how it's looking and you don't have to spend lots of money like this here it was one dollar and it already had the frame so you know you can make your own decor pretty easy and then this jar that I had was literally from the bathroom it had cotton balls in it so I just put that in with the q-tips at the moment because they're both running a little bit low and um, that will be fine for the next couple of weeks I can just pop it back so yeah that is just how we're looking at here these bunnies here I did mention it last year but basically I bought the did the bunny theme in her bedroom so then I was able to repurpose these after she grew out of the bunnies to use for Easter so I wasn't wasting my money because this guy here was super expensive he was from Adairs and this one here is a Ami Rose I think it's called um, so she's really expensive too so you know uh, just think about how you can repurpose things when you're purchasing things and being very very mindful this is all the stuff that needs to go back and as you can see I haven't even used barely any of it this one is the only one that I already had in the home that I couldn't put back in its place so it will just go in the Easter box until Easter is over and of course this is Talia's room the lighting's not great in here at the moment but yeah it's got this cute little light that changes colors and I've just repurposed the vase out here and I think it looks pretty good like it's not the exact good color like it would look nicer if it was in gold not rose gold but you know I think for a couple of weeks it's pretty good so guys I hope you all enjoyed today's video and of course if you did please give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bells so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos and I will catch up with you guys next week for a new video I'll see you then bye